So, do struggles have a purpose? I, I started asking myself this question. I struggle with an uh, with an, an an obstacle which I will tell you is not my my is not my height. Eh? Um, <laughs> I have what people call a, a, a speech impediment, as you probably can tell now. Uh, I, I I teach part time. I, I teach in a few schools, and I have a few students. I have. Um, one or, one or two. I, I have a few friends. I have one friend who I've known for about 12, 13 years. Um, two years ago, after going through this, this struggle with my speech um, for many, many years since I was in my late teens, two or three years ago, I started asking myself, uh, what, what do I do with this thing? Um, and, and that was a time when I, when I told a few of my, my friends and a few of them are, are quite close friends that I that I have this struggle, yeah. Um, some some thought when I when I spoke to a few of them and, and, and tell them that is there is something about me that I've been hiding and, and I have been hiding very well for the for the many many years that you've known me. But I have to tell you this very day. A few of them say, "Oh, you you mean you are probably gay?" <laughs> there is something which I which I um, occasionally I can feel that some of my students. They can tell, yeah. I have a starter, all right. I have a starter. I've been, I, I have started, I have started stuttering for many, many years. I think since I was um, 16 years old. Um, it's not one of those things that you that you have joy uh, because you have to live with it every single day of your life. Yeah, and I'll share with you some of the the very painful things. Uh, what it means when you have a starter, yeah. I have a starter, that's one, and I have what the, 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 what the internet says is called glossophobia, it's a very extreme fear, so it's not just fear, it's a very extreme fear that, that, uh, that, that a person uh, will, will experience when, uh, when he or she stands up on, on stage. Yeah? Um, I was looking for a word that, that can, that can um, explain this as I'm, as I'm speaking with you. Right now, my heart is pounding. Yeah? Usually, it, it beats about 60 beats per, per minute. I think now it's, uh, it's, it's probably two or three times. Um, so, when I, when I went online to look for a word, I, I found this word. I'm not sure if, if, uh, if, if that's the right word, but I've used this word. Uh, this is the third such talk that I, that I have done. Um, the, first, the first one was to a much smaller crowd of uh, 16, 15 people. Half of the half of the crowd cried, um, so I hope you 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 don't start crying. Um, so if you put these two things together, you will have someone who is who will face extreme challenges just coming up here to speak. And the interesting thing, as most of my friends say, but your day job is teaching, yeah. And I tell them, yes, it's amazing that someone who stutters and someone who has this. Uh, um, what is this word? Glossophobia. Yeah, can one day find himself the station of his life um, teaching people. All right. So when these two things come together in my classroom, uh, which I teach in, in in the classroom, my 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 great challenge will always be the one hour before break time. Yeah, I I, I don't know why. I'm much better after the the coffee break. So I, I started realizing that I not not that I don't just have this starter, but I got this thing where I will feel very very nervy um, in front of a crowd. Yeah, someone someone took uh, someone passed me this list of people who also started. I, I'm not sure if, if if my my good friend was trying to make me feel happy. Uh, there are famous people who started. Yeah. Um, King King George, one movie that I that I didn't watch. Why? Because I didn't have the courage to watch that 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 film. When I when I saw this, um, and this is just part of a long the uh, part of a long list. Yeah, um, there are famous people who, who managed to overcome this this problem. All right, life as uh, as someone who has this problem is very very tough. There are a lot of things that I can't do. Um, when I go out and buy food, it's a challenge. I have to rehearse in my mind when I'm in the queue what I'm going to buy, what I'm going to say, including no chili. <laughs> when, I, when I go and eat, um, when I raise my hand to get 
the attention of the, the waiter uh, when I was younger in my 20s. Um, it takes a lot. It takes a lot for me to come up here and, and speak with you. If you wind back the clock 20 years ago, 15 years ago, I will never be able to, to do this. Yeah? Um, so buying food is a challenge. Speaking, speaking. There will be words that I will not use. Yeah? There will be words that, that, I will, that I will try not to use. Um, if you have friends who stutter, they will tell you the same thing. Yeah? For some people, there are, uh, there are, it could be words that start with M. Yeah? I, I, I know of someone who, who struggles with words that start with M. For myself, I struggle with words that start with K. So I'm not sure why my dad gave gave me this, this name. I struggle with words that start with K. I have a problem with words that start with O. So when I need to say the word opportunity, I'll use this word chance. Yeah. You get by, you live with it. I struggle with words that start with S. So in the class, I never say shit. Yeah. Um, I think... <laughs> Another one or two words that I struggle with, oh, oh yes, yes, I struggle occasionally with words that start with C, yeah, C, K, K, S, occasionally O, and uh, words that start with B, yeah, very challenging, and if you have to teach, if the slides, if the slide point number three has a word that starts with B, um, one good thing is you learn to create new phrases and words that has the same, that means the same thing, yeah, Without the people who are here knowing that you have a, that that you that you started, um, when I one of the moments that led me to this, yeah, I, I told you that this is probably the third time that I'm that I'm doing this. The first time was one and a half years ago when, when my close friend, um, when uh, who is who is right here this 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 afternoon, um, I was sharing with him that uh, this is one problem that I have with my life. Three years ago when I. Uh, when I sat down and, and, and think, what can I do with this? I can keep the problem to myself. Yes, I can, I, I can deal with it. But one of the things that I started to, to see is uh, there is a purpose in my life. And, what, and, and the purpose is to take this problem out and share with people. Life, as, a, as someone who stutters, is a challenge. Um, when we talk, we are never invited to, to speak, yeah? except for this one. Right? Uh, I've, I've uh, not re received many invitations to speak. Um, I teach because teaching tourism is the only thing that I can do, and, that, and the contents are all up, up here for many, many years. Yeah? Um, life as someone who, who stutters can be emotionally very, very draining. Yeah. Even when I speak to my wife, I stutter. Uh, that's quite natural because she is very, very fierce. <laughs> so I stutter. I, I, um, one, of the, one of the things that I wanted to do uh, as, a, as a teenager was uh, I, I had this dream. I, I didn't dream to, to be a teacher. One of my, my dreams that I had when I was, uh, when I was, uh, when I was young Sorry, I'm, I'm still young. When I was um, 18 years old, was was to be a flight crew, yeah? So I failed on two counts. One was my speech, the other one was my height. The, the second one, I, I blame my mom. The, the first one, which, which is my, my starter, um, someone asked me this question, what do you think caused this starter? I thought about it for one, two years. I don't have the answer yet, yeah? I, I sometimes feel that um, it, it could once again be, be genes, but my father didn't, didn't, didn't stutter. Um, I thought it was some kind of uh, dark forces. I'm a Christian. There will be one or two slides which, uh, which may have uh, um, some, some verses from the scriptures. I, I, I hope it's okay with you. Um, my walk with God grew because of this stutter. And I'm going to tell you a few things uh, that this this uh, that this speech impediment brought me. Yeah, if I have to put in a title for this uh, 15, uh, 15 minute time slot speech, 
I, I will not call. I, I will not give the the, the title. Uh, I, I have a starter. If I if if I if I have the, the chance to to to, uh, to to title my uh, my speech, I will most likely call it um, um, the the purpose of an impediment. Yeah, it was about two or three years ago when I started to have a shift of of, of what they call perspective. All right. Because it was about a, a couple of years ago when I when I had one of the worst stuttering episodes, and it was in this school teaching a module I have always considered my favorite one. I can you can blindfold me and I can teach it, and 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 from from that day I, I started to to sit down and, and spend some time with myself. There were one or two questions uh, that I asked myself. Yeah. My starter is like a very high wall. When you look at a very high wall, there's only two reactions. Reaction number one is you can look at this high wall and you can walk away, thinking that it's a very, very high wall and there's no way that you can climb. The second choice, reaction number two, is that you can look at this very, very, very high wall and you can tell yourself that you've got to master enough strength to overcome this wall, which is what I... What I which is what I told myself that I would do. That was about three years ago. Yeah. So I, I, I started to look at this, this speech thing and I told, told myself that um, it will be with me for another 30, 40, a long, long time. Yeah. I can see it as a very, very high wall and, 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 and just walk away. Uh, but there's a, there is a, a, a better choice. I can look at this wall and tell myself that I have... That I, that I can and, and I have to, to scale it. So it, it was the, uh, one fine day three years ago where I started to tell myself that there are things that you can do to overcome this thing. Yeah? Now I, I shared with you just now that um, having an obstacle is not all bad. Yeah? Uh, in, the, in the first 10 over years, what I, what I felt and what I thought because what I see was all bad. People were laugh at me, and, and I, ha I have had quite a few people who would pour scorn on me. People who tell me things that you, you with your speech, you, you, it's very, very unlikely that you would ever make it on stage to speak. Um, some people were very shocked when they, when they saw me back 10 years, 10 years ago, 10 years, 10 years on, they, they saw me back, and, and, and when I told them that, that I actually teach, yeah? I think some of them would, would have um, uh, been very, very shocked. There was a few things that I discovered um, that having this starter actually brought, brought me quite a few things. Um, it made me mentally very strong because what, one of the thoughts that came through my mind is like if I can overcome or find ways to control this problem, there are many, many things in life that I can go forward and do. If I can find somehow ways to, to, to overcome this problem, um, the process will give me strength that I will need to meet with the, the challenges that I will face in my life. So th th those two thoughts um, came to me at a time, and I, I, I sometimes ask Myself, why why didn't I look look at this way ten ten over years ago when I when I had this uh, this this thing? This is one verse from from the scriptures that, that is very very close to my heart. Yeah, uh, as I as as the years go by, I started asking myself more and more what is what is what is one reason why I am going through this? Yeah. Uh, when God made me, there are so many people. Why did He lay, why did He let me have this other? All right, having an obstacle is actually good. There are more good things than than than, than bad ones. Yeah, the bad ones is that your speech will take a longer time because you started right. One one good thing is you can draw strength, which I shared with you. Yeah, you can use this to inspire people. You can let people know that, that um, where, there are, where there is a very high wall, there will come someone with, a, with, with greater strength that is required to, to scale this wall. Yeah. 
I started to be more hardworking. Um, I would take time to prepare. All right. I I, I discovered that with this father, uh, you I, you can you can never take away this wall. So one of the things that I that I discovered is that this father will stay with me most likely for a very very long time. So I can't change things that I can't change, but I can change things that I can. So I spend more time preparing for my classes. Yep. I will go through points. I will, I will rehearse in my mind what I want to say. All right. I have been rehearsing for this speech for five years. Having an, an, an obstacle makes you humble. Yeah. Because one of the things that I, that I told myself is, is uh, I will most likely be someone who is very, very arrogant and, and full of myself if one day I, I if, if one day people started telling me that, that I that I'm a very good teacher um, and, I, and, and I have nothing to control me yeah and the last one uh, is very very true it makes you it, it, it makes you build up more great I would like to end my speech with this verse This is one, one of this is one of the one of the verses which I which I will recite. Um, one of one of the, the verses which will come to my mind each time I ask myself those few questions. Why do I have to struggle with this stuff? And uh, the the last statement that I want to make up here is uh, trust your struggles. Whatever struggles that you are going through, trust them. Your struggles have a, have a purpose in your life. You just have to trust them. Thank you very much.